I'm showered. <laughs> you needed it. Yeah, I did. It's like 9 o'clock here, probably like 9.30 now. We're going to grab some breakfast. We're currently in the casino, and I'll show you where we're getting breakfast at. We're getting breakfast at the Pyramid Cafe. Very, very nice. We just need something to get it, uh, get us going this morning. All right, well, here is the breakfast menu. As you can see, everything's a little more expensive here. That's how they get you. It's not like a, like an IHOP where things yeah. are like eight, nine dollars. Yeah. Okay, they have breakfast nachos, okay? I think that's the lunch menu. I think that's regular nachos. Just put some egg on it. We can make it better. <laughs> What'd you get? I got the breakfast BLTA. Okay, which you kept calling B-L-A-T because what do we have at home where I the work? The salmon B-L-A-T. Yeah, so you kept mixing it up. Oops. And then what did I get? You got the country omelet. Country right? Benedict. Country Benedict. Which he said was the best thing on the menu, which in turn, Jen always says anytime I have food, I, got, I gotta have a bite of that. You know yeah. I gotta have a bite of that. Give me a bite of that. <laughs> Preferably multiple bites. There is the country Benedict. That does look very good. Looks good, right? And then yours. Oh, that looks fresh. It does it's look really fresh, good. like really good lettuce. Mine was banging. Sausage gravy is so good. It's anything drenched in sausage gravy or holiday sauce. I messed that up. Yeah. How was yours? It was really, really good. I'm still gonna eat it. You but... just had to take a break to eat mine. Yeah. <laughs> right, we are now exploring the Luxor a little bit because we haven't yet and the Titanic artifact experience discovering King Tut's and then these are both um, showrooms you can see Carrot Top, Carrot Top or some 18 and over fantasy show fantasy show and then there's the Blue Man Group I believe in this building right yeah that's so cool yeah and then there's a cool food court as well we're probably gonna go look at <laughs> My favorite. Uh, my favorite kind of place. They got a bunch. They got a Wahlburgers down there. They have bars. They have a Las Vegas sock market. There's a Ron John over there. Oh, nice. They had a Marshawn Lynch store back there. That was cool. And then they have uh, Vegas signs everywhere. Just a little, you know, little, little Vegas shop to get all your souvenirs. Probably cheaper than what you would get them at a normal, like, hotel store yeah. or something. Well, we just did the ice bar in Orlando, like the last time we were there. It was a cool experience. When we did our, our um, coolest bars in Orlando yes, video. That yeah. was a great time. Going down the escalator, and there is Muhammad Ali. <laughs> He's and then, shiny. I know, and then there's the entrance to Mandalay Bay. That's dope. Look at that. It's the House of Blues. We have one in Orlando. I know. And then they have, the, I really like this casino. It's, pretty it's very elegant. I love those like chandeliers and stuff. Yeah, very it's nice very, way. very pretty. This must be where the they do the concerts? Yeah. yeah this is the okay. And now we are back into the Luxor. This looks so cool. Where we're going to explore a little bit more. This place looks super cool. Look at that mural. decided to stop into the convenience store um, in the Luxor and they have like all this like snacks, snacks from from other countries like countries. a lime Snickers like, like I would love to try this do you want to you want to figure out what lime Snickers tastes like ew <laughs> that's gross there's a Spanish ham um, so they have these they got these yeah they have Spanish ham chips is what Jen yeah. said Interesting. I don't even know how much it is. It doesn't say. They don't have the oh, the prices on like a lot of stuff. Pink Oreos. Oh, they have more stuff right here. Yeah. Skittles. Kind of just want to get some of this stuff to try out. Yeah. <laughs> These are cool, man. Crossing over from the Luxor to Excalibur, the tackiest of hotels. Yes, but they have some cool photo spots up in the castle area. Oh yeah? Yeah, I want to get a photo over there. Watch this thing. Yeah, we're over the roadway and almost over here, which you can see the Excalibur right here. You see the little, little castle pillars. We're in like a little strip mall area. <laughs> dragon. Dragon's Lair, we should check that out. <laughs> That's pretty interesting, isn't it? Yeah, for sure. 
the big dragons. Jen is packing up. She's got to go to work. She does have to work for three days while we're here. She is modeling in a bridal expo. We're wearing pretty wedding dresses. That's right. Every day. That's right. So we were kind of like, this is a two for one trip. We kind of made it. She was working, but we were like, well, it's around our anniversary, only like yeah. a couple weeks after our anniversary. So we were like, let's make it an anniversary trip. So we have to so, so I'll work a little bit, but then we'll have six full days together. Yep. So we'll have a lot of fun. We are here for like nine days. We are. And I'm so glad because I wouldn't have just wanted to come here for work. I know you said you've always wanted to come with me to mm -hmm. on a work trip, but I'd much prefer us just like spending quality time together. Yes. And while you're working, mm -hmm. I will play. I hope you have a great time. <laughs> so you guys can come with me and check out what I'm doing mm -hmm. while she's at uh, working. Yeah, so. and I'll tell you all about it when I get back. That's what about the interesting fact about the elevator in here. Okay, so you know how it's on a pyramid? Well, that means that the elevator doesn't go straight up and down. It goes on an incline. Yes, so instead of going like this, it goes like... Show it this way. This. Yeah. So that's why it kind of like sways yeah. a little bit. We always wonder why it freaking jiggled and then Jen read this sign and this was it. Makes sense. Walk Jen to her Uber. She's going to go and then I got to go uh, explore. Yeah. Tell me how it is. He's going to tell me where everything's located so we can have an easier time to find things. It's like a maze time. in Vegas. Mm -hmm going up escalators, going through hotels to other hotels to get to like strips and things. All right, I'm on my own. I'm gonna show you some shit that I see. Jen wants to get on that roller coaster. I'm right underneath the Statue of Liberty. Just a cool shot of the strip. I am currently headed to the Target because I need some shampoo and conditioner because the hotels absolutely sucks. And it's Lids time. Took a quick stop in Lids. They're just hats and jerseys for days. And there's a second floor. Biggest Lids I've ever been in in my entire life. Taking the escalator up. Let's uh, check it out. Also, these neck fans, Amazon, 15 bucks, chargeable, work great. It's great stuff. Ah, basketball section, okay. Okay, football and baseball downstairs, basketball upstairs. I like it. Oh, they got some hockey stuff up here too. So baseball, football downstairs, hockey, and basketball upstairs. Little, little hat mural. I can't tell what it says from right here. I'm sure it says lids or something like that, but actually the first letter looks like it might be a V. So this place is sick. So I'm really excited about this. I love Stranger Things and they have an official Netflix Stranger Things store that was right by the lids right here. It's across from New York, New York. Um, so we're going to check it out right now. Here it is. Free experience. This is awesome. Super cool. It's gonna get bad. I'm probably gonna spend some money in here. This is awesome. This is so cool. <laughs> Oh wow, look at this. This is so cool. Look at this. I can't even, I don't even have words. I'm like speechless how cool this is right here. They got Starcourt Mall stuff. Let's see, how, let's see how much some stuff is, I'll tell you guys. Let's see. It's like, let's see for a hat. You're looking at, it doesn't even say the price on it. Hmm. I wonder if they don't have the prices on things. Let's check something else to see if that's just maybe that. Nope. Doesn't have the prices. Oh, 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 oh. I found them, guys. I found them. There we go. Of course, you gotta have the buyer house couch. 
shirts are sick. So it goes from the buyer house and then it goes over into Starcourt Mall. Awesome. They even got some Witcher stuff in here. Oh, other Netflix stuff. I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay, some Cobra Kai. We got Surfer Boy Pizza section. Oh, this button up is awesome. Look at this. This shirt's also awesome. Look at all this stuff. They got the guitar. Amazing. I would definitely get this. this little replica. So sick. That's awesome. They got some really cool stuff in here. Really, really cool stuff. I think Jen would absolutely love this hoodie. Again, guys, I wish I knew the prices. Um, sometimes there's a sign, sometimes there's not, like there is here. But uh, yeah, they got some really neat stuff. I think we're gonna go into the Creel house. Got some bobbleheads. They got the guitar again, which is awesome. Oh, so if you want the actual Eddie Munson guitar, replica. Here it is. Lights flickering. And then they've got a back now right here. Wow. This is another just little dark room photo, photo spot with the Demogorgon coming out of the upside down. It's awesome. So we just crossed over into Hawkins High School. Bunch of Hawkins gear. Well, again, Jen would probably really like this. And there we go, finally. Some of these things are hidden. Some of them don't have the prices listed. Some of them do. Um, I would love to see how much the Eddie Munson replica, uh, like the mini guitar is. And then they also have the arcade as well. And what prices? This is so cool. I'm like blown away by this like tribute store. Essentially, it says it's limited time, but it's a free experience, so I'll take it. Cool. The floor is awesome. All right, Stranger Things was awesome. Passing the big M&M store, it smells like chocolate right now. Now we're what we were really going to was, was Target. I got sidetracked. I saw the Stranger Things uh, store last night. We were heading back to the Luxor in our Uber, and uh, I was like, I gotta try this. So, um, happened to walk by it and try it out today. So, Target was uneventful. I'm a collector. I collect action figures and stuff. Thought I was gonna find some cool stuff in there. I had a buddy of mine who wanted me to check out to see if there was anything cool. Basically, just a grocery store here. But I did want to show these cups. So, they're different. All the cans you get in Vegas, you pop this tab, and then you just like slide it. And then you can drink it. I think I might go check out Brewdog. I might check out New York, New York. We'll see, but you know, stay along. Keep along with me in this heat. It's actually not too bad right now. It's dry heat. It's about the same um, the same as Maryland right now, but Maryland, it's like super humid. I feel like you can't breathe with this. I'm like, I feel like I can breathe. So it's good. Stranger Things store was awesome. Um, Target was uneventful, like I said. And uh, then I walked back, stopped and checked out New York, New York a little bit, which I didn't really feel the need to film. Um, came back to the room, felt like I was getting a little bit somber, went to find my sunscreen, which I put in my bag and it's nowhere to be found. Called Jen, she doesn't know where it is. I put it in a front pocket of one of the suitcases and it's gone. So I'm like, did for some reason the airport throw it out? I don't know. But I'm gonna go walk around the Luxor, might gamble a little bit, we'll see. All right, I decided to come check out the pool and uh, here we are. Very nice. And our room is somewhere right on this side because we can see the Raiders Stadium and the pool from here. We are at BrewDog and everybody who has a business here thinks they need to put it on a Vegas sign. This is the rooftop bar. Come check it out. 
brew dog was great. I kind of forgot to film because I met a couple guys there. We were we were hanging out. They were giving me a bunch of tips. Kind of forgot to film. I, I feel like I've been slacking a little bit. But right now, I am on my way back to meet Jen at the Uber. And then we're going to go get some dinner and show that off. So, yeah. She's back. I had a great day. The dynamic duo <laughs> is back. <laughs> we're no longer separated. I'm sorry that you had to deal with me all day. I know he's not as much fun as me. It's okay. I feel like we had a good time. I'm so glad. I had the best time working today. I had a good time too. I told him I made friends. I'm and so I, I, happy. I showed I started the show then Brew Dog and then I stopped. Because he made friends. Because I guys. made friends and I couldn't it was been weird to talk to myself while talking to new people. Yeah, they would think you're weird. Don't make fun of us for the luggage and shit on the floor. We are not we're only staying here for three days and we didn't want to unpack. Yeah. We wanna unpack at the Bellagio, not and here. That's just because, like all this luggage is out because I had to go to work and mm -hmm. like dig through my suitcase and find everything. But also, like, there's mine. I'm not unpacking. We decided that we're going to wait until we go to the Bellagio to unpack because yeah. we'll be there for six days. Yes, and then I'm sure their closets are nicer. They don't even give you a full closet. You look great, by the way. Aw, thank you. I'm just trying to figure out what you're in the I I reconned for the day so that I could be able to maneuver around Vegas to show Jen where we need to go while she worked. Cause it is, it's very confusing. It's like a maze. It's it really, confusing. really is yeah. to go from one casino to another and like mm -hmm. everything. It's very, very difficult. I believe it. I got, I even got lost the second time I went to go around being like, I forgot where I went. <laughs> so okay. do you have any idea where you want to take them with us to eat? I heard about the pure restaurant from my Uber driver and they said the food was really good there. And then um, I really did want to try the Italian restaurant in the Bellagio, but we can do that when we're at Bellagio. Yes. Um, Where's the other one you were talking about? I don't know. I have to look it up. Here, 89 or something. You gotta look it up. Then we can tell the people. Okay. If we get some seafood, we get some shrimp. Hmm. Some scrimps? Some scrimps. <laughs> some fish? Shoo! Gotta gas her up. God damn, Vegas outfits on fleek. I got lots of Vegas outfits. Shoot. Just you be worn. Yes, love it. Thank you. God damn. <laughs> we decided to go to Noodles in the Mandalay Bay. Is it the Noodle Shop? I don't know what it's called. It just says Noodles. There's multiple of them. I think I might see But they're the actually shop. very nice. Let's see they're what very it nice. Let's see what it says and, on the menu. And it's more like affordable than like... Yeah. Like, like, it I feel like it's like back home pricing, not for like appetizer wise, but entree wise is like around the same as back home. Yeah. I'm trying to show you it is the noodles shop. I was right. Because okay. uh, when you said I'm noodles, wrong. I was like, like you're right. I'm wrong. You're right. I'm wrong. I love. Here it. is the menu. See, pretty decent. Nothing over thirty bucks. I feel like. Yeah. No. Nothing yeah, over looks thirty. Yeah. Looks great. Looks great. That's hard to find around here. Yep. Uh, looks so good. What happened again? Second time today. When you go to order, they always say that's the best thing on the menu. And I know. Matt has great taste in food, and sometimes I do like his order food. Why is my phone grainy? If the picture comes up grainy, I don't know why. Video's not so grainy now. Oh, good. How is it? So good. These noodles are to die for. So buttery. You let me try it. They are very buttery. They're very good. This is some of the best like miso ramen that I've had. Everything yeah. we've had here has been so good. And the guy I talked to today, he said it has to be good because otherwise they won't last. They'll go out of business. So makes sense. Makes sense. So everything we've had here has been phenomenal so far. And we, we are excited about all the things that we are going to have. Yeah, we haven't even gone to like the restaurants that we planned on going to. Like made reservations for and things like yeah, that. Yeah, and even once we've saved online, like there's so many that we yeah. saw and haven't even been to. I know we've only been here like a, a day, day and, and a half, half. but still, <laughs> yeah, we have a lot to explore. I know. Keep watching. Dinner was good. Yeah, and then we got some yummy dessert. I know, I didn't film that though. Okay. It wasn't necessary. Yeah, I mean, it's just a lot of, but it's and now yummy. I'm so full. Oh. <laughs> my belly is like about to explode. Yeah, I can only do like a little gelato. Yeah. But now Jen wants to walk a little bit of the strip for the first time. Yeah.
kind of. I mean, we did kind of yesterday, but yeah, but you can tell me what's up. More down on what you know, our end. The roller coaster's going. Here's the Statue of Liberty. Uh, yeah, we're definitely. She's finally right out on the strip with me after I've been I've been just going all day. Jen's on the strip. Yeah, it's very hot out. I know. For sure. We're gonna see if we can get her in the Stranger Things. Yes, so. and some air conditioning, preferably, and then if we could see some cool stuff too, that'd be great. That's right. Stranger Things is closed. You gotta wait another day. I know. We'll go see if something else is open for you though. It's the M&M store. Looks just like the one in Disney Springs. But Probably. not like the one in New York. Yeah, 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 yeah. A lot of stuff. They got tie-dye. There's not much new that we're seeing in the M&M store. No. So we'll go to the Coca-Cola store. I yeah, think. we've seen cooler. We did make it in the Coca-Cola store. Yeah, they like... Just like Disney Springs? Yes, yeah, just like... In Orlando? But I haven't seen these. They're like Coca-Cola hair ties. I've not seen those either. That's cute. But I have seen these at Disney Springs. So I feel like... I don't really feel like showing off this store because I feel like we've shown you all this stuff yeah. in Orlando. In previous you know vlogs. what I mean? If in you haven't seen vlogs. those, watch them. <laughs> that was a quick stop in the Coca-Cola store. Yeah, because it's time for bed for me. Yeah. Uh, Jen just wanted to get a glimpse of the strip tonight. Yeah, see what it was uh, all about. Yeah, so, but she's tired. Mm -hmm. I have to work tomorrow. I've been at this all day. <laughs> there was nothing really new to show you. And everything looks very close, but it's not. It takes way longer to get to things yeah. than it actually is. Very so, we got a decent walk back, and then we're probably going to go crash. Yep, so, like it's a That's right. Good night. Good night.